Hello beautiful people, this is Aster T and we are back on the Boatcraft server season 2 episode 2. Um, so this is the island that we came out of, the portals, portals down there. Um, I did a lot of work since the first episode, <laughs> didn't get a chance to record but I really wanted to play. So what I did was take down all of the trees except for here, this is my tree farm. I there's some more trees all the way down there and then I I smelted all of it to make charcoal to light up the entire island um, I think most of the the caves that I found were lit up um, can't see down there because I decreased the render distance um, and then I planted a lot of this middle section out and we are going to start to build our mansion thing i guess sort of we're trying to trying to channel our inner our inner vintage beef and arcus and build something really cool these towers that i set up were just for um looking at the island i was using them to figure out where what spots needed to be that's loud what spots needed to be lit up some more I went through so many torches and then I did a, I had to do a lot of mining for iron and stuff because I set up my rail in this noisy ass portal. <laughs> set up my rail in another starts out really slow until it hits like the next couple um, powered rail. Let's make Let's make things really soft. Okay. Back to game. So that goes back to spawn. Still no spawn hub, an actual spawn hub yet. Um, I don't know if someone else wants to pick that up and build that. So right here we have our um, Enderman fighty fight spot here. And then... This is just a little starter hut. It'll probably get knocked down. And then I had a little starter farm that went down here. Some sugarcane, pigs, and sheep. There are no cows here. So I had to go all the way back to spawn and breed and breed cows. And then I got enough for the bookshelves, enchanting table, tree farm. Um, we need a lot of cyan wool for this project. I'm debating whether or not to play with a texture pack. I want to go back to playing on um, either the Max Maxcraft resource pack or the paper paper cutout. Paper cutout was one of my favorite ones. Okay, so for our mansion thingy we have here. Let's get rid of that. This is another viewing platform right here so this is the center and then I'm just testing out what these these side panels will look like I think what I'll do is build this middle section first and then worry about this sides over here kind of want it to be really big but I don't think it's ending up that that big as big as I was envisioning it because we're running out of real estate on this side we could expand on this side some more, we probably still need to to make it this length, but we'll see where it goes from the middle section, I guess. We're using sandstone because I like the beige color. I just wish that it didn't have that bricky, bricky sandstone-y texture to it, but the smooth, the smooth um, sandstone had it's just like really blocky like really blocky so it'll look like blocks whereas the, the sandstone texture here the brickiness of it kind of melds together from a far distance so it's smoother I guess smoother in, in the sense that the textures kind of connect so we'll go with that so far kind of liking this one oops where that indent is where I use the stairs up here 
where it juts out I think I'll keep that um, this is looking kind of plain right here so I don't know what to do with that just yet I don't want to end up using a lot of these to like make details it's kind of used plentiful in this one I like how this looks not sure about this strip I just wanted to add in a little bit of the cobblestone texture into this so that the sandstone isn't overbearing so yeah and this middle section I have no idea how to jazz up um, I'm really working on making sure that everything is not like on the same like it in indents here compared to compared to this and then it indents over here compared to the the Ford the, the this and it jets out here so I'm really trying to focus on varying those things which is what I'm doing here too um, these are going to be windows windows this window is going to have to be the same as this one and this middle one is slightly smaller um, Another mistake that I made was not building this high enough. Like, I wanted to add a, a better base to this thing, but I don't know if I want to tear it out. But what I got so far to fix that was raising up these windows and then adding the indent over here to all of that. Um, probably have to adjust this one. Um, I'll keep this one as is. If anything, we can just shave down the front of this, the dirt, if, if it really bothers me. But so far, it's looking pretty good. Um, I'm trying to keep these episodes at least like 10 minutes, not longer, because my internet speed is not helping the situation. And I would rather keep these at least 720. So yeah, um, spawn is looking really good. We'll go take a look over there. I forget who's been working. I think it's Andrew. Andrew spits lava, I think. I think. Either that or, yeah, I think it, yeah, yeah, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> He's been working on the, the spawn town, making it look really cool. I'll see you when we get there. Alright, so someone added torches to my tunnel for some reason. Every so often there's a torch. And now there isn't any. I think someone's been visiting, which is cool. I live pretty far away, it's like over a thousand blocks. And here we are at spawn. The little miniature, I mean not miniature, makeshift um, thingy is gone house thing. We have the farm here. Zodiac's lighthouse is over there. It's really cool. And then we have yes, that place. Very questionable about this place. Hmm. I hope you don't I hope you don't do anything illegal where the police has to come and get you. Harbor police. Um and this is the express. I, I came here recently. This, I like this. This is espresso lounge. This is, I like this. I like it a lot. And this pool, very nice touch. Oh, and these, these umbrella thingies, very nice touch. And that's the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, the, the pot, the farm stuff. Animals, that thing, yeah. Um, I still have morning voice. It's past three in the afternoon and I have morning voice. That's because I just woke up. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> oh yeah. The villagers removed to here. So all the zombies want to get in there. And there's no door. This is Andrew's place. Another wart. Nice tree. Lord Boozor's place. Very grand looking. Very, very grand looking. Um, what's this sign? Feel free for all. That's great. I need some of these. This wood. Um, I really like this pathway with the new stone. It really puts them to good use. 
let's see if we have any complaints. Third floor, second floor. No. Nope. <gasps> yeah. Okay. Um, by the way, if I didn't mention this before, Lord Bugzor donated um, the last the last few gold blocks that I needed to finish up the, the shield for this front area. Yep. And the, the antenna to receive any radio transmissions and stuff over there. Um, I gotta go back to the swamp. So I might hang around here for now. We're at also on the episode. Hopefully I get a chance to record soon before I make too much progress. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye!